with, with you, do you, like, how does it work with breaking new audiences for you guys in terms of prospecting? Are you just going entirely, you guys have so many purchases happening on a daily basis. Are you entirely operating on lookalikes or do you integrate other kinds of interest or demographic targeting on top when you're trying to break new markets? Yeah, obviously, like um, our conversion campaigns are heavily lookalike, uh, but we prospect constantly. And depending and, and depending on what we're giving away or what we're currently doing, we're prospecting interests only um, on top of the lookalike stuff. So I started to I don't have you ever heard of glue? The yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Shackleford talks about so, them quite a bit. Yeah, yeah, I love it, love it. Um, it allows you to build like heavy um, LTV customers. It allows you to like filter through your customers that are just super valuable, right? And it'll let you pull that and upload it into Facebook. So, so I've been able to make a lot stronger lookalikes using mm. that, you know. And then, and then we still do the interest targeting on top of that. But, but yeah, like it'll allow you to put like people who have purchased in 180 days, who have purchased like three times, who have spent more than three hundred dollars, um, and it'll spit out those people who have done that. And then if you can make the lookalikes of those um, and retarget those people, that they've, they've showed massive return and you still layer interests on top depends sometimes so what do you find in that effect with that like how does that affect it well well well, it depends what you're layering right so so for example we gave away a polaris razor this last weekend or it's like a side by side it's like a four-wheeler kind of um and and it was layered so i had all the people who had purchased in 180 days all this this ltv stuff but then who also had interest in Polaris, right? And who hadn't purchased in within the last week because we didn't offer that until the last week. So there is times that I'll layer in there uh, depending on what we're giving away or, or anything like that. But, but yeah, I still layer as well. Very cool. Um, so I, I pulled the office that I'm in here, the, the Helmkin guys, because they're a Facebook agency and they, were, they had a few questions. Um, they wanted to know, how do you typically break out your visitor retargeting? Uh, on a one day, on a five to 15 day or 15 to 30 day basis. So, so with my business model is different, right? Uh, we run six 